The bell about to ring. Richardson being stuck like glue to the back wheel of Lavreyesen. Tries to get that position. Gets a little dive down. Opens up one bike length. It's down to a half, though, because Richardson's gaining. He's on the back wheel. Is he going to come around in time? Does he have the speed? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, we've got a new challenger in town. The world champion's been beaten. And Matthew Richardson wins on night one of the UCI Track Champions League. Lavresen is human after all. He's going to have to lead it out here. Richardson in the position he wants to be in, maybe. And here he comes on the inside. Richardson's made the move. Lavresen pushed out the way. This is Richardson going. And look at the gap. He's got two gaps, two lengths out of turn four. And unless Lavresen gets back on turns here, that is a tactical masterclass by Matt Richardson. So Hoagland is at the front now, coming up to the bell lap. Hoagland is looking strong, but he's looking behind here. He knows that Lavresen is coming. But coming with him, on the wheel, trying to come around, trying to get high, trying to do his best out. This final one is Richardson, but here's Lavresen, there's Richardson. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Not enough to go top of the league, but he wins the race on the night. Matthew Richardson takes his first gear into the series. Now, this is interesting. Richardson looks behind and sees this. The Champions League could be in play right here, right now. And Harry Lavresen needs to make a move because this is Matthew Richardson going all the way. And there are bike riders between him and Lavresen. It's Richardson takes first, Lavresen down in a fourth. And Matthew Richardson not only wins the Kieran, but he moves into the lead in the Champions League. From Hurtiger there, but here comes Richardson. Bell about a ring, it's Lavres who's going to keep it going into the final 200 metres now. And he's opening the gap at least. He's opening the gap, Richardson trying to get back on turns, it's not happening. It's the chance for the late, late show. He's coming, he's coming all the way! And right on the line, Matthew Richardson has taken the Champions League crown. Late, late drama, and he left it right to the very last pedal stroke. It's the stuff of dreams. Lavresen knows he's been beaten by a superstar in the making. And this Champions League has given birth to a brand new big rivalry at the top of the sprint world. <laughs> but before whatever else needs to happen, here's the moment. Look at that. Matthew Richardson, victorious for the men in the sprint standings.